Do you like anime? Do you like Japanese inspired things? Do you like clothes? I'm sure you like to stay warm. Well, I got this stuff for you. Introducing Imori.com, a website that introduces anime and Japanese inspired styled clothing made in house. And you can use the code Uchi15 to save yourself 15% off of all these cool, dope hats, beanies, hoodies, t shirts, sweatpants, and way more where that came from. That's Uchi15 at checkout to save yourself 15% off your entire order at imori.com. What's up, everybody? <gasps> it's your boy Uchi, and, um, oh shit, and, um, back again. Once again, how y'all doing today? Alright guys, we got episode 5, The Crown's Fate of Tower of God. Now, I did read the comments from last week's episode, and I do have to apologize. Um, It did seem like some of the things that were said in the episode, I did miss. So I did want to take this uh, time to acknowledge you guys in the comments, because there was a lot of you that pretty much said the same thing, that I misunderstood the rules of this bonus game. So I don't know what it was that made me believe that they were gonna just skip straight to the top, and I feel like a clear indication for me at least was like the fact that Rachel is clearly involved in this whole situation and I figured like well it looks like they're gonna set her up to win so that way she could just go straight to the top and then Kuhn has you know that treacherous climb that he that he definitively knows that sh where she's at and where she is so that's my bad I just want to take that time take the time to acknowledge you guys and I, I'm totally sorry that I missed out on that and like I said I in, in, pa in past videos like I literally have have no problem with ever being wrong as long as you know you guys are pretty nice about it you're not dickheads so thankfully everyone that commented wasn't like a jerk about it some of you guys did recommend that i go ahead and rewatch it but honestly i really don't have that much time especially even being in lockdown there's so much going on elsewhere and all this other stuff that i i do want to you know provide for you guys so yeah so that was my bit for that so yeah going forward this bonus test is basically to skip all the other tests on this floor and then it'll just go straight to, to level three so again sorry hopefully you guys still stick it out with me i did notice that there was been a slight decline in viewership and and the sa same with the likes so just another friendly reminder guys please 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 like the video so that way the video is shown just like you know all the other reactions that are out there on youtube right now so that way you know we can obviously get more tower of god people and more manwa people and for those that might be wondering if i'm gonna be reacting to any other anime in the future well it looks like this this Tower of God ain't the only godly John out there that's a manual that gets getting adaptation. The God of High School, I literally just got put onto last night on my stream. So if you guys haven't been keeping up with my streams, definitely please follow me on my Twitch where we basically talk about, you know, all types of anime while we play some games and, you know, chill out together and all that good stuff. So yeah, The God of High School is slated to come out this July. So hopefully the schedule for that doesn't really change. And I'm really hoping that it still sticks to its, uh, you know, planned release in being in July, but it is not a, a plug for Webtoons at all. But I mean, we are kind of already reacting to um, a series that comes from Webtoons. The second series that I'm, people told me about it is, you know, also getting getting an anime adaptation so this is me telling y'all to check out the god of high school in addition to tower of god so with all that being said let's just get right Do you like Attack on Titan, Dragon Ball Super, Dr. Stone, Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood? Well, those are just a few of the several different hundreds of anime selections that you can watch for free with my trial code for Funimation Now. All you gotta do is click that link in the description below and check out Funimation Now for a free 14-day trial period to enjoy all of these anime and many, many more. That's Funimation Now by using the link in the description below. What do you gotta think about this song? I think it's a banger. He had all these crowns ready. What the hell? I need to know what's up with that bag. Yeah, that's what I was saying. This bag must have the power to copy things. That is busted. I wonder if he could copy other people's weapons and they have like similar effects to what the weapons, the original weapons would have. That would kind of be OD. They're all gonna try to kill the blue haired kid. That's Coon. Oh, here goes Rack. Take him out. He calls them his prey still. Ooh. Damn, the force of that toss alone was enough to take out the competition. Shoot yo. Gotta get the lip glossed. The real game starts now. Oh. He 
That was what? That was a uh, like a hair tie, John? I thought that was a part of his hair. What the hell? What kind of technology is that? My man got a little John going on now. What? Taking a break. I am so, what, what? Oh, the strongest points will come out in the final round. Okay, so he gonna chill with him. He gonna let Rack handle it maybe? Is that where we're going? I like his design. I like how comfortable Kuhn is. He literally just posted up on BAM like no big deal. Like, okay. I didn't know y'all was that friendly already. What the hell? Oh no. What kind of freaking power was that? Kuhn pretty much predicted this would happen. What a smart guy. You gathered allies in the bag? What? So he basically made alliances with them prior. Oh, he... Oh, wow. So he stored them in his bag so that they could pass. Okay. And the bandana was the signal for them to help him. That's... That's fire. What kind? What? Dude, that, that sort of thinking was next level. Good shit to Kuhn. He didn't want to use them yet, but he's probably getting ready for the final battle. Has to win the game. Oh, so they already handled it all and they're already good to go. They're about to go right back into their junk. So now I think that they actually do have a chance at winning this. Oh, okay, we still have some other people left. Oh, snap. I didn't realize. I thought they were just going to be like the one team. Rachel's team is who I'm referring to, obviously. Oh, snap. Right between the eyes. Damn, whoever the hell that is is destroying everybody so far. Whoever this is is doing all the work. Uh-oh. All right, we got Mr. Ponytail, man. He was on the thumbnail of this episode. It's Rachel. It's Rachel. It's Rachel. They're not going to steal the crown. She's trying to be deceitful, though. All right, let's see. She's still not revealing herself. Oh, their third partner is making sure he don't get off the chair. That's so weird. Now I really am interested in what the hell they're plotting. Ooh, man, he threw mad knives. I feel like if they ever made a Tower of God fighting game, Kuhn would probably be the most busted character because he could just make and copy things, or he could just copy stuff out of his freaking bag and store stuff, like, he'd be OD. Yeah, I don't know why they're helping them either, but... Ooh, slice and dice! Yeah, they only have, like, 30 seconds to last. If she actually manages to remove that mask to, to, to reveal who's under that mask, I'm actually curious to see. Ooh, crack the heel. Oh, oh, oh! Uh-oh. All right, let's see what this guy's all about. Oh, ooh, heavy hitter. All right, Rachel, you're up. <gasps> and there it is. Nah, you cannot leave that. No, bro. The stress levels. He left the... Oh my god, took a direct shot to the forehead, or back head, actually. Damn, he's bleeding hard. He has to protect Rachel. I knew it. <gasps> What the hell? What is going on? The soundtrack is OD. It's very fitting. Yo. Oh, snap. I like her hair, but she got cut up. You've lost control. What is this? What is this? Who in the hell? It froze time. What the? Oh, okay. That's the, that's the, that. Oh, I remember her. Okay. I remember her. Okay. Gave him a nice kiss on the cheek and called it quits. Wow. Is that the power of that sword that he has, bro? The Black March? Ooh, what's he playing on the Vita? That is a big ass hammer that he's due to send it on. Damn, that dude's a giant. So many characters in this freaking show. It ended without a winner? Bruh. The crown was destroyed. They got a three day break. Holy crap. The real reason why you want asked me to run the crown game. Okay, let's look at some answers. Quant? Oh, wow. Acquaintances cannot compete in the same tests. So the point of these tests is to, to see if the people that are taking them have the power or thoughts that might harm the tower. There's some behind the scenes politics going on here with these administers and all that. Oh, she looked like she had a nice face. Bam himself became Shinsu? What the hell? Damn, my man still knocked out. It's Rachel. There she goes. The re the actual reveal. Okay, what's her request? She's probably gonna tell Kuhn to tell Bam to not worry or care or follow her or try to or any of those things. That's a prediction. Yeah, yo, so honestly, it really does seem like there's some ish going on behind the scenes amongst the administration and all this other crap because they was talking about things that are not allowed and other rules like acquaintances and people that use Shinsu uncontrollably. That Like, that's not even allowed. Like, a lot of interest Interesting things and, it, and it, it makes me more curious about Bam because Bam he seems like he's got this ridiculous power that he don't even realize and did you peep that the lizard chick 
had the Black March. I'm pretty sure that was his sword. So we're gonna have to see what happens in episode six because I feel like there's gonna be a, if, if, if that was truly his sword, the Black March, then that means that they're probably gonna have some kind of part where he's gonna have to get that back or I don't know. But they did just say that he became Shinsu, which is like the power. So he became the power. If I'm getting this right, he became the power. That's, that's kind of wild. This is adding to the, the how godly Tower of God is. My round of applause is basically what I just said during that ending song, and yeah, I am I am very much uh, now more, like looking more to continuing the story. And as far as the manhwa update goes, guys, I'm sorry to say this, but for the second week in a row, I literally have not done any further progression with the original story. Funny enough, I, I did read the first 10 chapters of The God of High School because of the hype that was ensued off my stream yesterday. So again, quick plug to the, to the Twitch. If you guys want to discuss further anime, things with me, definitely catch me on my Twitch. You can talk to me live. As far as Tower of God is concerned, the story really seems like there is a lot more to it than what is presented right now. Like, I feel like there's a lot more than just like these people just trying to get to the tower and to the top. There's like a lot of things behind the scenes that we're not really aware of yet. But with all that being said, I wanna know what you guys thought about this episode and all your thoughts, what you thought about the situation with Rachel. And again, please no spoilers. And I will do my best to try and catch up or read a little bit more into the story of, you know, the manhwa. So drop your comments down below. Like, share, subscribe. Please like the video first and foremost. Make sure you're taking care of yourselves. Have a good one. May the power protect you. Keep it locked loaded right here on the Uchi Games channel and stay clean, stay safe, and stay inside. I'll see y'all next time.